Place your knees hip width apart with your big toes touching. Lift and bend your chest to your knees and head to the floor. Slide your hands in front of you. Make this an active stretch by activating your fingers, palms up, elbows off the floor, and sliding your shoulder blades onto your back. With each breath, you should fall more deeply into the stretch. Hold the pose for 5 to 10 deep breaths. Under your hips and your hands under your shoulders. The spine in neutral, parallel to the floor. As you inhale, curve your spine, bringing your tailbone upwards and looking up towards the ceiling. As you exhale, hunch your spine, bringing your spine towards the ceiling. Slowly and deliberately continue the movement back and forth in tune with your breath. Continue for one to two minutes. Start in the downward dog, then inhale and draw your torso forward until the shoulders are directly over the wrists, torso parallel to the floor. Press your outer arms inward and firm your fingers into the floor. Press your front thighs up toward the ceiling, but resist your tailbone toward the floor as you lengthen it toward your heels. Lift the base of the skull away from the back of the neck and look straight down at the floor, keeping the throat and eyes soft. Hold for five breaths. From downward dog, step your left foot between your hands. Bring your right knee to the ground. On an exhalation, set the right elbow onto the outside of the left thigh and bring the hands together into prayer position so the left elbow faces up. Press into the left knee with the right elbow to rotate the trunk. Continuously root that back foot and keep your back long without collapsing. Stay in this position for 30 seconds to a minute. Return to Downward Dog. From Downward Dog, step your right foot between your hands. Bring your left knee to the ground. On an exhalation, set the left elbow onto the outside of the right thigh and bring the hands together into prayer position so the right elbow faces up. Press into the right knee with the left elbow to rotate the trunk. Continuously root that back foot and keep your back long without collapsing. Stay in this position for 30 seconds to a minute. Return to Downward Dog. From downward dog, step into a high lunge on the left side. Ground your right foot parallel to the back of your mat. Come to standing with both legs straight. Raise your arms parallel to the floor, palms facing down. Extend your torso to the left, bending at the hip. Rotate the torso to the right. Rest your right hand on your shin or the floor. Stretch your right arm up in line with your shoulders. Look softly at the right thumb. Stay in this pose for 30 seconds to one minute. Return to Downward Dog. From Downward Dog, step into a high lunge on the right side. Ground your left foot parallel to the back of your mat. Come to standing with both legs straight. Raise your arms parallel to the floor, palms facing down. Extend your torso to the right, bending at the hip. Rotate the torso to the left. Rest your left hand on your shin or the floor. Stretch your left arm up in line with your shoulders. Look softly at the left thumb. Stay in this pose for 30 seconds to one minute. 
Return to Downward Dog. Standing up, inhale, shift your weight onto your left foot and lift your left heel toward your right buttock as you bend the knee. Begin to lift your right foot up away from the floor and back away from your torso. Extend the right thigh behind you and parallel to the floor. Stretch your left arm forward in front of your torso, parallel to the floor. Stay in this pose for 20 to 30 seconds, then return to standing. Standing up, inhale, shift your weight onto your right foot and lift your left heel toward your left buttock as you bend the knee. Begin to lift your left foot up away from the floor and back away from your torso. Extend the left thigh behind you and parallel to the floor. Stretch your right arm forward in front of your torso, parallel to the floor. Stay in this pose for 20 to 30 seconds, then return to standing. Lie on your back. Bend your knees into your belly and grip the outsides of your feet with your hands. Open your knees slightly wider than your torso. Then bring them up toward your armpits. Position each ankle directly over the knee so your shins are perpendicular to the floor. Gently push your feet up into your hands as you pull your hands down to create a resistance. Release your tailbone toward the floor. Hold the pose steadily for 30 seconds to 1 minute, then release the feet back to the floor. To exit, first roll gently with an exhalation onto one side, preferably the right. Take two or three breaths. With another exhalation, press your hands against the floor and lift your torso. Sit in a comfortable seat. Press your hands together in prayer and bow forward. Namaste. Bye.